Alrighty, hello everybody and welcome back to the channel and welcome back to part three of the Anderson Legacy. So I just want to say I'm recording this about 1030 at night and um, ever since the neighbors, or not neighbors, apartments done a renovation on the upstairs neighbors apartments when the last neighbors moved out, um, you hear nothing but footsteps and everything like that. So... <sighs> If you hear it, I apologize. Just ignore it. We're going to deal with it, okay? I've been having to deal with it the last, like, three months of constantly stomping and just everything. I'm just over it. So, anyways, we are back here. Um, I skipped a day because I actually went ahead and uh, populated the world with story progression. So, we do have a couple new faces moved in and stuff like that. Also, I realized what I did wrong was because I had opportunities and jobs clicked instead of all. So, pardon me. Um, another thing is I wanted to go ahead and move them into their high-rise apartment. So, that is what we're going to be doing today. So, we are going to go ahead and real estate and move within this neighborhood. We're going to pack our furniture because I do not want to have to buy all this stuff again. So, we're going to pack it all up. We're not going to sell it. And I have a apartment already chosen. I really haven't looked at it because I didn't want to like exit this because they have the uh, the move into a high rise building uh, want. So yeah. Okay. So we're going to pack furniture. We're going to do a house. And the high rise building is this one right here so it is a penthouse so it might be a little expensive but you know we're gonna roll with it we're gonna give them their dream and wishes which is to live in a high-rise building so this is a charming two-level penthouse with a nice outdoor balcony with private garden features two bedrooms two full bathrooms does not come furnished so we're gonna go ahead and click that okay um, we are going to be having 6,621 simoleons. <sighs> so we're going to roll with it. Okay. So this is our new, our new household. Um, you know, this is what they want. They wanted to move into a high rise building. So this is what they're going to get. See, she's so excited. Like she is so excited. Um, hopefully his, uh, whatchamacallit actually is in the inventory like his workout and stuff like that and he broke his phone so there is something else that we're gonna have to fix here soon so there's that but i'm excited to see this apartment you guys um i also want to say that i did delete some of my enros mods because i was having a lot of like lag issues and stuff and i was just not having it so i deleted like the career i did delete overwatch and air trap and um a couple other things but i had to oh my god there's like a communion oh, that is so cool so we'll do our laundry dude that is so cool okay okay so we're moving on up in this world you guys not really um all right let's see this okay okay Okay, okay. Ooh, that's actually a really nice balcony. Holy cow. Okay, so there's one bedroom. And then here's the other bedroom. Ooh, I like it, actually. Um, okay. Okay. Your furniture can be found in the family inventory. Perfect. Okay, so I'm going to go ahead and get everything out here. All of our lights went inside, too, which is because we can just go ahead and place these around and not have to buy new ones. We might have to, what are you doing? Why can't I put you, there we go. Might have to buy a couple more. Um, yeah, we'll have to buy a couple more. So it's bright in, up here. This is going to be like the office area because it leads to right outside of the patio which is like perfect i like that um and then also we're gonna go ahead and actually move this over here i will change the wall colors and everything like that very very shortly um actually you know what i'm gonna move this over here i'll move this right there 
Um, and the... Actually, let's make this the office. Upstairs can be their bedroom. I like that idea better. Um, I don't know how to go up and down floors. Oh, Paige, okay. I figured it out. I figured it out. Learning as I go. Okay. We are also going to purchase another light so that that shadow's not right there. Okay. And then we are going to go ahead and add the bed. Perfect. Um, and where's the nightstand? Am I blind? Yeah, I'm blind. There's the nightstand, and then we have our dresser, which actually needs to go into the corner, so I will have to move this over one. Perfect. And then this can go right here, actually. Okay. And then I'm going to put the, uh, the bathroom stuff up here. And then I'm actually just going to copy all of them to put down below. Where is... I thought I had a mirror in the bathroom. I guess not. I guess not. Okay. Actually, you know what? This is... I'm going to turn this into our kitchen. Yeah, I'll do this as a kitchen. That seems a little bit better just because I feel like... I feel like one bathroom is just fine for them. So I'm going to open this up. Um, and then I'm obviously going to change this. I'm sorry if this is not what you wanted to see for this part. But this is what I have planned for this part. So this is what we're doing. Um, I'm going to change the flooring because it's it's a no-no. Um, carpet's fine. Is this like... Yeah, okay. I think it's... I think that's what it is um okay so now i'm gonna go back into the family inventory i might actually make that tile oh my god are things dirty do i need a now we're good um might actually buy one more oops there we go. Perfect. Um, and then our sink can go right there. And then our TV can go over here along with our couch. And that. Perfect. And our dining room table. I'm going to go ahead and grab... Two more of those. Perfect. So this ain't gonna be pretty. Um, but it's gonna work. You know? I'm gonna go grab that. And then I don't remember where this was. I don't remember. I think it was I think it was on this table. I could be wrong. And didn't we have a fireplace? Yeah, but we don't have it no more. Um, I guess we can just go ahead and... Wait, where, why can't I put this up down? Oh, there it goes. Um, and then this can go back in the corner. I'm going to have to turn on. There we go. Perfect. Alrighty. And then, <clears throat> because I hate this color of this wall, we are going to go ahead and change that. Um, to just a gray color. Um, nothing too crazy. Just like that. And then also in here. Actually, you know what? I'm actually going to just like accept that. And then do this. Perfect. Um, that can change. That can do that. We will, we will work with this, okay? We will work with this. We obviously don't have 
the most money. Oh my god, we can change the outside of that. <gasps> that is so cool. Perfect. Okay. And then this. Um, I don't remember what color I had their bedroom. I think it was like a dark gray. Yeah, that looks fine. Alrighty. And then I want to make this this flooring and then out here I don't know what I want to do um how does this look that looks better um the only downfall is like I can change up here but I can't change down here you know you know what I mean I guess we'll just do some paneling of some sort it's just some simple paneling to make it a little bit a little bit better we'll put out his workout equipment out here actually look let's do it over here so that he can like overlook everything and then we will eventually like add on to this and stuff like that perfect i like it i hate this though but I like it. It looks good. It's super simple. And they have all their stuff. They just packed it up in the van. And here we are. Also, I can't get this to delete. Like, I can't get this to delete. And it's for her old job that I actually had her quit. Um, So, I don't know if I like these doors. I don't know. Um, What, what even is it? An archway to heaven. Yeah, no. I'm going to change these doors actually before I forget because no I don't like them I just like the plain brown doors um there we go and then we will go ahead <clears throat> can we change this one? Ooh, we can perfect this one actually can be an archway because it makes a little bit more sense because it is just the office, you know? Um, so we'll just do this. And then we will just add that. Perfect. Also, if you guys hear my kitty in the background, she's in heat. So don't mind her. Okay. Um, and then we will do a front door. Nothing too crazy. Um, yeah, no. An apartment, that would be really weird. Let's go up. And then just copy this. And you get out of build mode. Okay, perfect. Of course. Of course. Let's just make sure everything else is good. Of course not. It's because I have moved move objects on and it tends to do that. Okay, I think that looks perfect. So they are actually going to bed and I, I think not. I think, I think not. Okay, so I don't know how much our bills are. Um, I don't know where like our thing is gonna be like where do we pay is it downstairs it might be downstairs yeah call residence mailbox yeah we don't have anything we can't really look wow we are literally at the very top oh my gosh that is insane okay so i know you're super tired so i'm gonna just like bump this up a little bit and I'm going to have you go get your last skill that you need. Um, he just needs one more skill. He wants to buy a hot tub. Girl, yes. Let's do it. So we have room up here. Um, so we could totally do that. Dude, this is so cool. We have like the entire view of everything. I love it. Why didn't I think about just putting the mental apartment in the first place? Like, please explain to me why didn't I do this in the first place? It's so much fun. Okay. So with that out of the way, we are here. Um, 
We are... We still need to meet some people. Um, leisure day obviously was gone. Um, because I did the day to... Uh, uh, spawn some people in. So we missed leisure day. But it is the weekend. So it is perfect. Um, we can plan some stuff. I also wanted to show you guys i created a cute little wedding venue and it's literally nothing crazy um it's just it looks like this and it looks like this in the inside um but i was having trouble like being able to find a wedding venue that wasn't like packed full of custom content and i just didn't want custom content that i didn't know that in my game um so yeah i built it instead and yes, um, no, we don't, we don't really need to do our laundry. So you are going to get your last athletic skill. Perfect. Um, he wants to go for a jog, um, and work on his handiness skill. And she wants to gain a celebrity star level. I don't know where anybody like celebrities are. I don't know. Um, I don't know if it's going to work. Um, I'm going to go ahead and save because I haven't saved from us moving and everything like that. This saver mod is from Enros and it just kind of reminds you after like 15, 20 minutes of playing to save your game because as many of you guys know, Sims 3 is very, very good at crashing. When I was building that wedding venue, I was nervous that it was going to crash because it kept like lagging whenever I went into build mode. Uh, buy mode is fine, but, like, if I swap from, like, build mode to buy mode, oh, my God, my computer. Not really my computer. My game is, like, you need to stop this right now. It's it's kind of ridiculous. Um, okay. All right, hopefully, hopefully he can get his last skill before it's too late. But, anyways, what I was going to say was I actually, I want you to cook something first. Um, serve up some mac and cheese. I want them this weekend because they both have Saturday and Sunday off, which is freaking perfect. I want them to go on a cute little date and I'm going to have Donald propose to her finally because they're just boyfriend and girlfriend. Um, so I'm going to have them propose and, you know, maybe do a risky woohoo. Because, you know, babies. Um, and then we can start working on, like, the wedding and stuff. Because I definitely do want them to get married in a few parts. Uh, which is why I created that wedding venue so fast. So, yeah. That is my plan for the next couple of parts. Is just, you know, having fun. And playing The Sims 3 again. Like, I still have, like, you know, some lag here and there. And, honestly, I... I could, I, I'm going to put up with it because I miss this game. Like, I've been, one second. Ava. Hey. <whistles> Ava. Oh. Ava. Enough. Freaking cats. Um, <laughs> but, yeah, so I've been um, binging Prisma's Generations last play. And, oh, my God. It has reminded me of how much is actually in this game that Sims 4 does not have. And I know Sims 3 does not run the best. Probably never will run the best. Um, but the amount of stuff that is in this game is so crazy. And honestly, a lot of it came with Generations Pack, which is why it's everyone's favorites like you got bachelor parties bachelorette parties prom um there's anniversaries for your job so like after like quote unquote a year of being in a job they do like an anniversary party like obviously it's a rabbit hole and you don't know what's happening until you get a pop-up that it happened um teaching teens to drive um it's just everything it's just i don't know so much is missing in The Sims 4, and I'm trying not to compare them, but it's really hard not to because, you know, Sims 3. Um, okay, so I'm going to have you whoa, go upstairs 
and use the toilet and then you can go ahead and sleep. And I'm gonna go ahead and auto lights, all lights, perfect. And I want you to go until you have reached level six. So, so Donald can now train friends and family that are as athletically inclined. Wipe down the exercise equipment and get those lessons started. Perfect. He does want to train somebody, but honestly, we don't got time for that. So, yeah. You're going to go eat um, and then take a shower and then go to sleep. Because I don't want you to go to bed. Stinky. Peel. Um, she wants to learn a new recipe. Oh, dude, I totally should. I don't know if I have to go to the bookstore to get the recipes. Um... I think so. I think I have to buy recipe books. So I definitely am going to have that on my checklist of things to do. Um, so yeah, I think what I'm going to do is I'm just going to let them sleep till the AM. Um, and I'm probably going to cut this part right here. I know it's only been like 20 something minutes. Um, but we, I did what we wanted to do. Oh crap. So since uh, so since the, those washer machines are on this lot, these are going to show up. So I'm going to have to get the mod where it's like an, a bottomless, not a bottomless, but like anywhere in the house, you can put this hamper and all of the clothes go to it. So I will have to find it. <sighs> Hopefully I can find it. Um, so that I can install that because I don't want hampers in every single room you know? So just put one in the bathroom and it's a okay. Um, but yeah, so I'm going to go ahead and end this part here and tomorrow. Yeah, I think tomorrow we're going to propose. Um, and yeah, we're just going to get this family and this show on the roll. The first couple parts are kind of boring because I'm literally not doing anything besides trying to get their life started basically like if I would have like worked with him a little bit longer um it would have been fine but we would have like lost out on like the young adult stage and stuff and we would have would have had to like instantly be adults and I just don't want that so um yeah but anyways I'm gonna go ahead and end this part here um and tomorrow we'll find some place to go for a date um, maybe I will put like a restaurant down. I don't know if, if there is one down here, but we definitely will do that. Um, and then maybe like go to the beach and have him propose. Oh my God. I'm so excited, dude. I'm so excited. Um, anyways, but <laughs> I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I hope you guys have an awesome, awesome day. And I will talk to you guys all in my next video. Bye everyone.